In this tutorial, we will learn how to connect the drone to Bluetooth. But first, what we need to do is we need to put the battery into the drone. So if we take a look at the drone here, this is the front side. What we need to do is we need to flip it around and notice there's a spot for the battery to fit in. This battery right here actually needs to flip over so that the little clips right here are facing up and then this side right here actually gets inserted into the drone. So I'm going to go ahead and snap that in and then rotate the drone around so you can see what's happening. So notice that the drone itself is blinking its lights and that's actually green. It might look a little yellow to you at the moment, but that's green and what it's doing is it's looking for a device to pair with. So I'm going to go ahead and switch over to the tablet now so we can take a look and see if we can connect to the drone. Okay, so we're back into Tinker. Now before we actually connect we need to make sure that our Bluetooth is enabled. So since I'm on an iPad, if you're on an Android you scroll from the top down, but on an iPad I'm going to pull up my options, make sure to enable Bluetooth, scroll on down, click on my airborne drone, and then next I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on this little joystick. So it says it's disconnected, so what we have to do is we have to wait till it actually sees the closest drone to us and that could take anywhere between 10 to 15 seconds to maybe 30 seconds. So it sees the Mars drone. I have to wait till it turns or, or green as we can see here. It shows me that it's connected and that the battery is connected. Next we want to do, since we're not going to be flying this around from the controller view, this is just kind of flying, we're going to be programming, let's go ahead and close out the controller view. Click on the X, and that's how you connect your device through Bluetooth in Tinker. 